Yo, welcome everybody to Pocket Monster Dom with your host, Pikachu, the Chonkachu you've all been waiting for. This is a Vivid Voltage Elite Trainer Box. I'm going to be opening this for your viewing pleasure today, ladies and gents. Thanks for tuning in yesterday as I uh, made some alterations to my backdrop. Ooh, cleaned it up. I noticed it was dirty. So I'm cleaning up my life, folks, okay? Uh, let's crack into this thing with my trusty opener. Hey, there we go. No keeping it sealed now. I have one that I'm keeping sealed, but this one specifically got at GameStop for the channel. And I'm very excited. I've opened one before. Oh, look at that. There he is. There's a bit of a texture on the box kind of cool and uh, what do we have here I guess on the inside of this it's gonna be blurry but there's pictures of some of the Pokemon not the best pictures and a player's guide well, let me show you what's in here got a big fat Pikachu it's very ominous some of the boys and the girls. Hello. This guy we're after. Because he's fat. Um, I like this card. I I want to say... I've pulled these two. So, hopefully not those. I think I have this one. And blah, blah, blah. Books and books. There's a amazing rare Rayquaza in here. Yada, yada, yada. This guy right here, uh, I think it's just like a reverse hollow version. Though. Then here are all the cards. I'm not going to go through all of this because it's boring. I want um, the amazing rare Raikou. I have it in Japanese. Let's see. Amazing rear Zacian. Amazing rare Zamazenta would be cool. Um, I like looking at these books. I don't know. Some people just throw them immediately in the trash, but I think they're thoughtful. You know, they they kind of prepare you for what you're about to open. Uh, that was Jirachi I just showed you. I'm definitely looking for this guy. You can notice a theme here. It's all about Pikachu in this set. Um, especially this guy right here. He's going for about three to 400 bucks online, which is crazy. Um, really love this card. have it in Japanese. I sold this card to a, a kid at GameStop. He was in line, and I pulled it. The um, Age of Slash. Very funny. Then we got some hyper rares and some gold cards. That's the book. Sorry. Now we'll get into the packs, which you've all been waiting for. Cardboard. Wonderful. We've got rules. I don't need any. Sleeves. Get out of here. We have some pack arts. What do we got? Looks like a uh, Orbital, a uh, Pikachu, uh, I forget his name, and uh, uh, Celebi, right? I don't know what voice that was, but welcome to my head. Uh, I have some sleeves here. Gonna use some Champion's Pad sleeves. Let's get right into them. Okay, eight packs, put them in a nice little stack here. So if you're new to this world, it's super addicting and I would not advise it, honestly. Just buy the cards you like, um, unless you're balling and you don't care. And you can even ball on a budget, you know. I'm going to put four cards to the front. I always look at the back card because... I have a problem. Um, Kakuna. What? <laughs> Sir Chester Bath? Okay. 
Galarian Stunfisk. Like, why does he have a Pokeball for a mouth, dude? Oh, Eevee. Uh, message me if you want this Eevee. Okay. Trubbish, he's literally a piece of trash. Guys. Um, ship it. It's a sheet, bro? Come on. Like, are we trying anymore? Choodle. I kind of like this guy's buck teeth. Rylu. The reverse is Kimiko. And got a Galarian non holographic Berserker. Okay. On to the next pack. Come on, big boy. Give me some of your wisdom, your infinite chunk. If anybody's uh, wondering, I always open packs at the top as to not damage the pack art. Because in my mind, I'm going to use the packs for um, custom booster packs in the future. All right, so four to the front. I'll tell you right now, this is probably not a good card. Just looking at the back, I know I'm like a wizard. Opal, Matang, fake ass Toys R Us giraffe, Skiddo, boring. This cheap man, Ferro seed. He's a metallic seed, folks. Uh, Joltic. Sandile, Woobat, and Holographic Dialga. Kind of cool card. I like that. Um, so I'll just put anything holographic in the back. Going to get this out of the way now, folks. My hands have been shaking my whole life. So, yeah, maybe this isn't the best job for me. So what? Leave a comment. Tell me how you're feeling. Here we are. Code card. Four cards to the front. And this looks like a good one. It has all the makings of a good one. Energy, Charmeleon, my guy. Pinchurchin, what? Telescopic sight. That just looks like a toy, folks. Whooper. What a guy. Love him. Ninkata, very boring. It's a bug. Wismer. Drillbur. Claymation. I like the claymation ones. Uh, Whalmer, wow. A reverse, Hollow Milkery, and Orbital V. Here we go. Some of the V cards I like, some I do not. Um, that's fine. We'll take it, right? Um, here we go. Next pack. So how y'all doing? I, I appreciate everybody watching the video. I want you to subscribe. I want you to like the videos. It really does help. I know everybody says it, but that's just what it is. You know, people, uh, they need to get in the algorithm's favor. All right. Four to the front. Here we are. Metal Energy. We've got Loudred. It's very loud. Wind on Stadium. Zeb Stryka. Pika Peck. Picky Peck? I don't know. Trudel. Riolu. Kimiko. Nikita. Uh, that's a reverse aromatic energy and Flareon. Cool. I like the Flareon. I'll put you in the back. Just because Flareon's one of my guys, so girls. Got an Orbital pack here. Looks like we are flying through these. We have four more packs. Okay, so stay tuned. I'm going to try to keep this uh, sweet for you little babies out there before bedtime. This is going to be a good card. I can tell it's curved. Good. Water Energy, Galvantula, Swallow. My hand looks large. League Staff, Kimiko, Blitzel. Slugma, Beldum, in the trees, he's just looking at you in the bushes with that creepy eye. It's like uh, working for Google or something. Oh, baby. It's like this might be a twofer. We got uh, Amazing Rare Jirachi, which I really like, and a Steelix V. Okay. All right, Steelix. Sure. Why not? You can join. I'm going to throw this one in a sleeve. I do have this Jirachi. I have it in Japanese. I have one in English and now 
I have my second in English. So maybe I can trade that for something I need. Put you right there, bud. All right, next pack. They make this look easy, man. Opening packs. I um, I was going to make a Pokemon wraps for you guys. A little wrap segment. Um, but I think I'm going to hold off on that one. Okay. Comment what kind of wraps you'd like to hear. Um, it's going to be four cards to the front. I do not see a, a hitter on the back. But I've been surprised in the past. Dark energy. Stone energy. Electric? Come on, bro. What is this? Kakuna. My guy. Rockruff? It's just a dog. Um, a little claymation bird. Yanma. Majestically sitting in a pool whooper. Uh, Dedene. Okay. He's sitting on a branch and maybe on a tea a cup. Reggie Rock, Gigi, and Lichen Rock. Next pack, we only got two left. I'm going to save the big guy for last. I really do want to pull that chunky rainbow Pikachu, that big boy. Sorry, I just burped. Um, four to the front. Here we are. And got a leaf energy. League staff. Krokorok. Aromatic energy. Pineco, Clefairy, Tynamo, Milkery, Larian Meowth, a reverse, Pincurchin, Churchin, I don't know what the frick that is. And uh, I don't even know what that last one is. Whimsicott. All right, there we go. I did only pay, I think, 30 something bucks for this because they were 20% off, which is cool. Last pack, come on. I'm not going to cheat myself on the... Oh, I saw the card. I'm not going to cheat myself on this. Let's see what we got. All right. Dark Energy. Here we go. Last pack. There's actually another art with, where this bird is swallowing that uh, fish alive, eating it, and devouring it. Picky Peck, uh, Puccina, getting caught in an alley. Guess where he was doing graffiti? Maybe. Rock Rough. Uh, reverse Telescope and an Orbital VMAX, which I've already got. But kind of cool texture on this card. Um, so I guess let's do a little recap. We had, we just saw Orbital VMAX. The Amazing Rare Jirachi, which is the best pull, for sure. Uh, Flareon, Aromatic Energy, Hollow Dialga, and Orbital V. Not bad. Did not get what I was hoping for, but that's how this thing goes. Folks, I've got a whole mess of cards in front of me here now. Um, let me throw them in this box. And then there's a couple things I want to... I've got a package in the mail. And I'm going to open it um, in the video. So I don't know what it is. I ordered it. Um, and I'm not sure exactly what it is. But I didn't peek. You can see it's still sealed. Da -da -da. I'm going to try not to give my address so you creeps don't find me. Um, while I have you here. Tell me what you liked about the last video. I'm learning. I'm not a professional. I do have a podcast. I am a performer. Um, so I do like doing this stuff, but I'm, I'm new to, to being, I guess, by myself, you know, in a channel. And uh, really loving it. Loving the prospect of it. Let's see how this is packaged. Nothing else in there. Okay. Looks like I must have got this off TCG player because I've seen them packaged like this. They just put the receipt. And what is the card going to be? 
And there we are. Shining Hollow. Yes. I do recall ordering this. And they did a good job because they taped the bottom. Open this up. And we're going to take a look at the card, and then that's going to be it, folks. I uh, don't want this video to go too, too long. Be careful taking this out. So these shining cards, they're really, looks like they double bagged. Um, they're really cool. If you don't know the shining cards from, like, vintage sets, they're very sought after. They're very valuable. Um... I don't know if you're going to be able to see this as well as I am because this camera is not the best. But I'm going to take it out of this sleeve. And when I'm looking at it like this, I'm looking at the corners. I'm looking to see if there's whitening. See how you can see the little edges on the corners kind of. This. Shining Legends has a lot of this. Uh, it probably won't be a 10. The card could be... A PSA 8 or 9, so long as it's not damaged. It's a little bit off center in the front, uh, left to right, and sort of top to bottom. The, the centering isn't great, but I'm not that upset with it. I kind of like it. Um, thank you guys very much for watching. Please subscribe. Consider subscribing. Um, if you don't like it, you know, don't worry about it. Um, but please uh, tell your friends. That's what I wanted to say. Tell your friends. Pocket Monster Dom. Going to be doing this more often. We're going to be talking about cards. Uh, stuff like this. Silver Metal. Pikachu. Um, rare stuff. You know, like more exclusive, harder to find things. Because I'm sort of drawn to that stuff. With the stamp from 2006, you don't see that gold stamp on this card all the time. Um, thank you all for watching. Smash that like button. Subscribe. And uh, have a good evening, folks. Be well.